Hi everybody, today we have a little toy to review and it's from the My Little Pony little fandom but we remember we just got a quest to make Space Pony for you so to make this Space Pony we're gonna first review our toy so here is Trixie so Trixie with the new packaging here is her name. The back of the package is like the uh, old one. So now the old with the previous. So you can see her. So here we're just gonna open so you can have a look. Here is the figure. She has her cutie mark on two sides. We have her double, so she's gonna be the perfect space pony. I like her, actually, her cutie mark is super pretty nice. Her main style is so cool. Also her tail. Oh my god, I really appreciate her. So we're just gonna recolor her mane here and her tail. We're gonna need, of course, some glitter to make the nebula and everything. And here we're gonna need colors. I don't know what I put about the, uh, the blue glitter. It's really missing. So we're just gonna use it. I just wanna make a long tutorial. Take a look on the figure, the wall figure. So cool. Her hair here is amazing. Her smell is awesome. So she she's not really perfumed. Also she's not really painted well. So we're just gonna remake her. And to make that we're gonna need the glitter like we reviewed. Some blue. Blue acrylic. And we're gonna need also red. So what colors do you want? Also we're gonna need just some shades of turquoise. We're just gonna need three colors. So here is the figure. So don't worry about Astro because he's not gonna be uh, the painted. So she's a perfect pony here. We're just gonna make textures of the colors. So we're gonna need some coats, but we don't need, really need the undercoats. So she's gonna be an amazing pretty blue pony. So she's not going to be very, very perfect. But I want her to be just awesome. Because I don't want her to be just a pony, I just want her to be good and everybody likes. So we're just gonna put here some red. And of course, as varnish, we're gonna need the super blue glue that we used, cyanoacrylate. But not too much, because we're just gonna use some coats over her body to dry her and everything. So here we have more blue, so we're gonna use another type of blue, so it's, it's amazing for the night sky. And super fine brush. So we'll maybe use some... Uh, I think this is the only one figure that I don't... that I didn't use the the white. So... because the... oops. So... we're gonna wet the... Uh, put some water and then you can get the color part right away. Check your hands if they are clear or not, then start painting. So the first we are going to put the amazing color, it's about to be my favorite. So it's the dark blue. I'm going to start these. Like that, so we're gonna paint the wall figure like this technique. Just the caution.
So the front hair is mostly done. We are still have the tail and the uh, the back hair. The back hair now. So here is the main dawn. Now we're going to be in the tail. Well, the tail is the bigger surface, so it's going to be a little bit easier, but not too easy. She's like Minuet in her colors, so she's pretty nice. another coat
So you can let her dry to pastel or pastel the other colors that you're going to color with. And if you don't really have a very wet atmosphere or I mean dry atmosphere so you can use an amazing technique for it. Uh, you can turn off the fans or expose the acrylic to the light. So this is an amazing experiment. So we have here the strong, the strong lights. So here, these are the strong lights. So you can turn them on. So as you can see here, sorry for that. So this is not really bad, but you can expose it to this. That's it. So you can let her dry like that, and then we'll, we'll should dress, you can mix your, the rest of the color that you want to do. Good news, we found the blue glitter, so the, the figure is going to be amazing, and it will look exactly like we uh, just predicted above. Our space pony is here, again, she's back. As you can see here, she's perfect. And we're gonna continue her painting. So, we're, without really washing the brush, because the colors must really get a little bit so close. I'm gonna take the other blue and we're gonna keep on. Oops. So be careful. Don't really want to destroy the figure. Yep. I think she's already beautiful. So the color is now going to get darker. We'll mix in it with the other blue. Beautiful shades. Shades of blue everywhere. <laughs> I really make it to make you feel that you are seeing a space pony for real time. Okay, so here is the, the main, so we're going to keep mixing the blue till we get like the same color. So it's not the same, of course. It's so close. And we're going to make some beautiful shades too, but also using an amazing color. And you know, we're gonna use also some magenta for it. So the magenta is gonna give us amazing shades. So she's gonna be beautiful. So here is magenta, we're gonna mix. And we're gonna get like some shades of purple. She's not limited. Try to keep on without making any of these stupid streakies because streakies may destroy that. 
and that's the nightmare of anyone likes art. Streak is destroy the figure and make it really bad looking. Make the light really, uh, <laughs> I don't know how to describe it. Here in the shade. It's beautiful. I think the main section is done. Now we're gonna pass to the tail, the tail section with the same technique and the same color. Something else is disturbing this because, as you can see, She hasn't got specified colors, so both colors can also get mixed on the figure, on the same section of the hair. The indigo became like purple, and that's super gorgeous. I am done with the creature that I made. Okay, so now we're gonna just put and use another stuff. So now we're gonna just remake the indigo to get an amazing color mixture.
And here she is. I think now she's so pretty nice. Pretty, huh? But the fun hasn't isn't over because we're still we still have more fun and more danger. So as you can see here we can we had some extra paint over her. It's close to her cutie mark, so we're gonna just gonna need to dry it and then clean it. Here I painted her. So I just added some shades of blue over her mane and tail. And I hopefully you like that. Because the next step is gonna be harder. She's already beautiful, huh? <laughs> Time for cyanoacrylate. See something in there? It's so hot. <clears throat> this is made of cotton, so the cyanoacrylate reacts with it. And it's so hot, if you touch it here, it'll... I feel it, even my nails felt that. So it's so, 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 so bad. Even it smell, it smells horrible, moreover. So here is the first coat of cyanoacrylate, and it's really dangerous, and I feel much pain in my eye. So you mustn't really touch something with cyanoacrylate, and get it please far away from your eyes, because now we're gonna be starting the glitter so the glitter is just have to wait till this these dry the first coat dries so let the pony a little bit aside and take in some of the glitter and mix in it so so here is the glitter three colors blue uh, white I mean silver and purple so you can see here it's like the galaxy colors now this is like a little pencil but it isn't so it's just a little some of the cotton that we're gonna use with the same acrylate on only the areas that we will put The glitter on it so just put it oops like that like that you can see now here here now on the other side oops oh. here we are gonna use that so the problem is the this piece of cotton just dried so it's gonna be a little problem Done with the main section, so you can see here. She's beautiful, God. Now we're gonna pass to the tail. Same technique. So. See her tail is glittery. Mm -hmm. And now on the other side the same thing. So okay. Oh, we'll need another one. So we're gonna try to use that directly. Oh it's so very bad, so don't 
Oops. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. So, ouch, ouch, ouch. Mm. I don't really. I wasn't gonna need that. Okay. Cyanocrylate is bad for your health, so. Try to keep away from. Here is the glitter. I think it's clear here and here and the all of course the other side I see her cutie mark it's not glittery. You just have to do that. And then you should sign acrylate it all with the last coat. Here is the space pony. Here she is the accomplished custom. This is our space pony. How she was Trixie, and we turned her into space pony. But thank you guys for watching and enjoying our paid in tutorial video. So hit like, subscribe, and comment. And don't forget that space is everything like science. So the future is now. Fine.